Nikola Tesla was way ahead of his time. He envisioned a bright and positive future for mankind as he patented and created hundreds of technologies that no one before had envisioned nor dared to imagine. It is rightfully said that the Croatian-born inventor was a man who changed the world. But the elite are not allowing us to enjoy the benefits of his real legacy. The elite are threatened by Tesla and his vision of a positive future for humanity. 73 years after the FBI seized nearly two trucks of papers of one of the world's most famous inventors, the Federal Bureau of Investigations released the documents to the public. The batch of documents made available through the Freedom of Information Act also reveal that Tesla did not die on January the 7th, 1943, as previously believed, but a day later, on January the 8th. In general, the FBI documents revealed a number of details that changed a lot of what we know about Tesla, his life, his inventions, and his legacy. In this video, we'll take a look at seven lost inventions by Tesla, which many people are unaware of. Number one, Tesla's UFO anti-gravity technology. Actually, it wasn't unidentified. Despite this, the methods and design of Tesla's revolutionary vehicle is believed to match the description of people who witnessed disc-shaped flying objects or UFOs. It is believed that Tesla's UFO had eyes made of electro-optical lenses arranged in quadrants allowing the pilot to see everything. Screens and monitors are placed on a console where the browser can observe all areas around the vehicle and Tesla's incredible invention included magnifying lenses which could have been used without changing positions. Evidence of such a vehicle can be found in an interview between Nikola Tesla and the New York Herald from 1911. My flying machine will have neither wings nor propellers. You might see it on the ground and you would never guess that it was a flying machine. Yet it will be able to move at will through the air in any direction with perfect safety at higher speeds than have yet been reached, regardless of weather and oblivious of holes in the air or downward currents. Its lifting power will not depend upon any such delicate devices as the bird has to employ, but upon positive mechanical action. Number two, Tesla's death ray. Prior to the release of the declassified documents by the FBI, many people argue that Tesla's death ray was just another conspiracy. Previously, it was believed that Tesla's death ray did not exist, and the FBI claimed for over a decade that none of their agents had ever investigated Tesla's papers, nor was the Bureau in possession of any of them. However, after the FBI published Tesla's files, we learned that among the published files, a letter addressed to J. Edgar Hoover, the first director of the FBI, highlights the importance of an article in which Tesla speaks of the death ray and its crucial importance for future warfare. It was recommended that Tesla constantly remained under surveillance in order to protect him from foreign enemies who may also have an interest in the secret of such an invaluable instrument of war and or defense. Number three, free energy and wireless electricity. With the help of funding from JP Morgan, Tesla successfully built and tested the famous Wardenclyffe Tower. The structure was a massive wireless energy transmission station which, according to Tesla, had the ability to transmit wireless power across great distances. Tesla saw the Wycliffe Tower as the beginning of a massive free energy project. Tesla wanted to use the tower not only to transmit free energy, but to send out messages and telephone calls across the Earth. As explained by Tesla himself, the Earth is like a charged metal ball moving through space, which creates the enormous, rapidly varying electrostatic forces which diminish in intensity with the square of the distance from Earth, just like gravity. Since the direction of propagation radiates from the Earth, the so-called force of gravity is toward Earth. His theories were based on the idea that our planet had the ability to conduct the signals. Using a number of different towers, Tesla could have made the idea work. However, as we've learned through history, the idea of free energy isn't really welcomed by big corporations. After all, why give free energy to the masses when you can make the masses pay big time? Eventually, Tesla's funding was cancelled and the tower was destroyed along with Tesla's ideas of a world powered by free energy. Number four, Tesla's oscillator. This device was an electromechanical apparatus patented by Tesla in 1893. This device was popularly known as Tesla's earthquake machine after the European inventor claimed that one version of his device caused an earthquake in New York in 1898. In other words, the device could allegedly simulate earthquakes which meant that it could be weaponized. Some conspiracy theorists are convinced that Tesla's technology was later further developed and is being used by HARP. 
Number five, Tesla's futuristic aircraft. In addition to creating devices that could potentially be used as weapons and structures that could offer free energy to the world, Nikola Tesla also worked on electrically powered airships that, according to reports, could transport passengers from New York to London in three hours. These aircraft were not ordinary vehicles. They were supposedly able to harness energy right from the Earth's atmosphere and had no need ever to stop and refuel. But why have aircraft that makes use of free energy if billions can be made by selling it? Number six, drones in 1898. More than 100 years ago, Tesla invented drones. So everyone who thinks that drones are actually a product of recent technologies, you're wrong. It was called Tesla's Teleautomaton. And the funny part is that the government had this technology in their possession for over 100 years. This raises a number of questions. Is it possible that they adopted, further developed and used drones more than half a decade ago? Number seven, propulsion systems for spacecraft and Tesla's dynamic theory of gravity. While we discussed something similar in Tesla's UFO, the truth is that he went beyond flying objects. In an unpublished article of Man's Greatest Achievement, Tesla outlined his dynamic theory of gravity, saying that luminiferous ether fills all space. Tesla said that ether is acted upon by the life-giving creative force. The ether is thrown into infinitesimal worlds at near the speed of light, becoming ponderable matter. Then the force subsides and motion ceases, matter reverts to the ether. Mankind can harness these processes to precipitate matter from the ether, create whatever he wants with the matter and energy derived, alter the Earth's size, control Earth's seasons, weather control, guide the planet's path through the universe like a spaceship, cause the collisions of planets to produce new suns and stars, heat and light, originate and develop life in infinite forms.